Hello you man buddy. Okay, here's a really cool one. If you got Maya 2023, only Maya 2023, then if you get the bonus tools, uh, you can download the bonus tools for free. Uh, if you got Maya 2023, any Mayas, you can download the bonus tools. Okay. But Maya 2023 comes with a special tool. Okay, it comes with uh, under bonus tools. Download it, install it, and uh, under modeling, you'll see speed cut. Ooh, click it and you'll get it up there. Okay. So we're going to create a quick uh, polygon, something like that, something, something simple, you know, just to show it off. Uh, lift something, maybe something like that, and bring that down like that. Okay, uh, this is cool. And then I'm going to take the edgings, and I'm going to bevelings, and I'm just going to put a little bit of segments, okay? Something like this, okay? Alles gut, alles in Ordnung, richtig krass, geil. Okay, so how we get started <coughs> is select your uh, power to gown, whatever, and over here you'll see no base mesh set okay so i'm going to click it with it selected and now it's set that as the thing to be cut okay now we get cutter we get like a little star shape three five six that's the uh, the amount of sides that you can create like if i click a three and i click it here you see it makes like a three-sided thing i'm going to delete that i'm just going to select the one for now and i'm going to just click and drag on it now once we got this thing you can do whatever you want with it i'm going to set this to zero so it's in the middle I'm going to bring it up, I'm going to uh, pull it out like this, something like this, and I'm going to set it something like, something like, something cool, something cool, something like, oh yeah, yeah, that's cool, that's cool. Uh, remember, you can also, you can uh, set the vertices, you can, you can change what you want about it, you can model it, you can do whatever the hell you want with it, which is cool. Once you've got that, uh, I'm going to hit, go down a little bit here, and you can say bevel, bam, you can bevel it cool that is and you can say smooth okay so i'm going to smooth it out nicely look at that oh hell yeah hell yeah yeah bring it out a little bit like that something like that something like that that's looking pretty damn sweet eh? god damn okay and once you finish with it you can literally just click on the next thing that you want to cut so i will create like a, a draw a three five but there's a draw down here if i click draw then I click and hold and you can just draw and then let it go and then click again and you can set the, the whatchamacallity, uh, uh, depth and hat. And over here you can set this in. So I'm going to bring this over here, something like this, something like, something like this, bring it in like that. Oh yeah, yeah, that's good, that's good, that's good. Maybe bring it in something like that, you know, something like that, something like that. That's pretty nice. Once again, I'm going to bevel it, I'm going to smooth it. Uh, I can bring it in more, kind of like this, see if it works. Nah, nah, I like it like that. You know, bring up the segments, and I can do this, mirror Z. Now I've got both, look at that. And once again, you can just continue drawing. You've got control, uh, bevel, smooth, gap. Uh, you have mesh symmetry, mesh radial mirror, alignment pattern. Look, we'll get into... A bigger tutorial or lesson on this uh, but you can play around with this this is just a very quick start for you uh, and once again you can just continue you can then make another shape do whatever the hell you use once you know set it zero bring it up uh, so it's uh, nicely done and you can just continue playing till your heart is content girl. Look at it. bevel smooth bring up the segment something like that and something like that and look What's beautiful about this is nothing is uh, distractive. Look, show all, and, and it'll show everything that you've done. And you can go ahead and you can still change anything you want about them. None selected. If I have one selected, boom. So this is absolutely awesome. Non-destructive, and you can create everything you want. So once I'm done with that, I'm going to create none. Uh, and once you're done with your object, you can just hit finalize. Bam. Once I finalized it, I have my shape and it's ready for retopology or whatever you want. But look how cool and easy that is. It's actually a lot of fun. Uh, anyway, so if you're jealous of Blender's tools like Fluent and uh, Hard Ops and the other one, uh, Box Cutter, uh, well, we've got something like that now. I don't know if it's uh, as good as those or whatever, but it's pretty damn cool. Anyway, uh, thanks for joining me and I'll see you guys soon. Bye, guys.